chapter 16, lesson 3 is about perimeter and areas. So we've seen the area uh, approach already. Now this introduces the approach for perimeter. So the perimeter is technically the total length around the figure, while the area is the complete coverage inside the figure. So for perimeter, what we need to do is count all the number of box that outlines the figure. Okay, and for area, we count the number of boxes itself. Okay, so again, for perimeter, the units will either be centimeters or meters. And for area, the units will be centimeters squared or meters squared. Okay, so for uh, this lesson, the uh, page number that we will be working on is page 144. And I've selected problem number one. However, I will not draw out all six figures, five figures. I will only draw out three of the five figures. Okay, so these are figure A, D, and F. Okay, so here it asks us to fill out a table, but clearly we're not going to fill out all because I only put out A, D, and E. Okay, so it says to find the area and the perimeter. So my suggestion here is to do just per, uh, per figure, look for the area first of all the figures and then go to the perimeter. So example area A, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, area B, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And area E is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, these are all area, so centimeters squared would be our units. Okay, for the perimeter, my suggestion is to count in one direction around Okay, now there are times that the kids will overcount. So what's best is to maybe write number one. There's where you started. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So that means this is fourteen centimeters around. So again, I'm gonna put it here. One. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So that's 20 centimeters around. So again, have your kids count around and put a place where they started counting so that they don't overcount. So here's my number one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So that means that this is 12 centimeters. Now, since I don't have all the figures, the questions that come after filling out the table, cannot be answered as of the moment. So again, I just needed to show you the strategy to finding the perimeter since we already know the strategy for the areas. That concludes lesson three of chapter 16. See you in the next lesson.